Hello. Hey. Hello, Hi. Jack. Chris. Chris yeah. Na? Or yeah, Chris? Hey. Which, can you, can which, you do you, which, which do you like, Chris Na or just Chris? You can call me Chris. Chris, nice to meet you. I'm just checking out your wall behind you. Lots uh, of... I, uh, or something. Are you using a, a, a kind of graphic image in your background? Oh, behind me here? Yeah, that's a, a digital back wall. It just, just, it's called Expressions Camera. Wow. Oh, well, I don't... Tell me a little bit about that. <laughs> It's a it's a, a an app or software that you can download to your computer, and uh, it uses your image in your camera to remove everything behind you, and you can put other things behind you, or you not, can listen to me, Jack. But it's not functioning properly because I can see your head and body, something a kind of fuzzy image. I can around see around me, yeah, around me, yeah. When you move your hand. And it yeah. shows some blur, fuzzy, fuzzy. Because image. it's digital. Yeah. There's no green screen. It's digital. Oh. oh, are you in a matrix? Am I in the matrix? I think life is the matrix, don't you think? <laughs> uh, so, uh, so, hey, Jack, how you doing? I'm good. Where are you from? I'm from the eastern part of India. Eastern, eastern part of India. Okay. What's what city is that? What's what is it a big city there? Yeah, um, well, there are 28 states, mm -hmm. right? And I live in Jharkhand. Okay, okay. And what what do you do? Is is your wall part of what you do? Part of your job? No, uh, like uh, I'm a student, right? And oh, okay. Uh, I study. So what are you studying? I, uh, I study language and uh, science, physics. What do you want to do with it when you when you graduate? What do you want to do? <laughs> like I, when I was kid, when I was a kid, I always wanted to become a scientist, uh, become an astronaut. And uh, when I grew up, as the time went by, I realized that astronaut or scientists are not my thing. Like. It's, I oh, I lost my interest in in science because now I have uh, now I have a little bit of interest in uh, learning different languages. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I find it a little bit you know difficult to understand the uh, science theories, scientific theories, and uh, um, okay. Well, I, beg, I still remember when I was in twelfth grade uh, when I was in high school. Mm -hmm. I was very good in physics. I could easily understand the concepts of laws of motion and uh, three dimension motion in three dimension, and uh, you know laws of gravitation. And uh, mm -hmm. there were so many stuff. Uh, okay. Magnetic, magnetic effect. But now I don't really like that. But I. <laughs> <laughs> So you're more interested in learning languages now. Your English sounds really good. There, like your accent is is very neutral. I like that. So have you been uh, have you been learning in other countries? Have you traveled, Jack? Well, to be honest with you, I'm not lying to you. I've been living in India for 24 years. I'm old, and uh, I've never been to any English speaking countries. So I have learned this language by my by myself, and uh, I've been working on on accent, the American pronunciation. Uh, I deep down I know that deep down I know that somewhere I make mistakes, grammatical mistakes and pronunciation mistakes, but that's okay. It's it, it is natural. It is common. There you go. Exactly. It's natural. You're going to actually you're going to hear native speakers probably make more mistakes than second language learners. So don't worry about that. I do hear a little bit of British twing in there a little bit when, when you do certain <laughs> certain. But do, 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 you hear, do you hear that, you know, the Indian accent? 
Not so much the Indian. I hear, I hear British. I hear what? Oh, I uh, now I get it. Now I get it. Now, what are you yeah. trying to say? I understand the intonation. Yes. Uh -huh. Well, uh, the, the, yeah. that little there, there's a little British twang, you know. When, when, <laughs> Just when... because you know what, Jack, I'm telling you, I really love watching Game of Thrones and other uh, <laughs> English TV series. So when okay. I watch English TV series, I'm like, I, I change my accent. So it happens. Like uh, uh, I still remember that when I uh, started watching Breaking Bad and Friends and uh, you know the Big Bang Theory. So then I started to speak with an American accent. But I, you know, the the change, the, the change in accent, the sifting in action, it it happens to me all the time. Sometimes I speak with a mixture of accents, uh, which you may sometimes call it like a hybrid accent, but it's that's mm -hmm. okay. So when I you're watching Breaking. Oh, go ahead. Go ahead. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, I'm asking you a question. Am I understandable to you all the time? Easily. Easily understandable. Easily. Yeah. <laughs> That's good. That's My good. question was going to be, when you're watching Breaking Bad, did you have more of a Jesse accent or a Walter accent? Uh, well, I like really bo both their accents. <laughs> but you know what? I'm telling you something. When Jesse speaks, he speaks with that, uh, you know, yo. Yo, Mr. White, it signs, right? And Walter has a very good accent, like the deeper accent, right? Um, so he, you know, I, I, I can understand. I, I can understand him easily. And there is another guy, Mike. Mike, the bald guy, yes. And uh, he has a very good accent, the Southern accent. And when he speaks, that sounds really good, like, you know, uh, Sylvester Stallone. Do you know about that actor, Rocky Balboa? Sylvester Stallone. Uh -huh. uh, Stallone. Yeah, I'm sorry for that. Okay. Stallone. Okay. Yeah. So, so he speaks uh, exactly the same like Sylvester Stallone. Mm -hmm. New England, Northern Pennsylvania, New York accent. You know? <laughs> Pennsylvania, New York. Pennsylvania, oh. Philadelphia, and the New York, New Jersey accent. Talk so, a little uh, like this, you know, they talk they talk out of their nose. Oh, 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 oh I got it, I got it. Like like how did you say that? I, could, could you could you just do you it? Gotta, again? You gotta you gotta pro, you know pronunciate more up here in your nose. You gotta talk like this, you're gonna be from New York. Philadelphia, you know, is a little slower. Because they, they, they got to, they, you don't, you don't move your mouth a lot. You don't move your mouth a lot like that. Yeah. So. <laughs> but for me, I'm an Indian, right? But I think that if I, if I stretch, if I, if I go deeper and deeper into that accent, I would sound more, you know, I would sound funnier. But that, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Because it'll be, it'll be unexpected, but you would be. Well, actually, if you go to New York, you're going to find that that Indian, the the immigrant Indian uh, British accent. You're going to find that if you go to New York, because they live in close communities and and they don't um, they talk like a New Yorker, but you can hear definitely hear the the Indian accent in it. But if you're like from Philadelphia area or New Jersey area. They've been there a while. They've been there longer, so they're going to talk more, more like the locals talk, because it's it's that it's that um, '70s and '80s uh, generation that has that sound to them. So the longer they've been there, the more they're going to sound natural. So, but yours, if you have a neutral and you're learning all different accents, all different levels of English, that's better. Because then you'll fit in everywhere you go. Don't worry about it. You're doing great. So, so now explain explain your backdrop for me. I, I see a lot. Um, of, I see some anime. I see some sci-fi. I see yeah. some Breaking Bad. So, what what is your favorite genre of of genre? Of, okay, I really love watching you know action movies and some kind. Of, you know, sometimes I like. I love watching drama, um, so uh, I'm a big fan of <clears throat> Marvel Cinematic Universe, and okay. I really like reading Marvel comics. And uh, 
sometimes I start, sometimes I watch TV series, the American TV series, and uh, a few minutes ago, I have finished watching Breaking Bad, and okay. it was really dope. Did you, did you, have you seen Better Call Saul? Oh, well, I was about to, you know, watch that TV series, but I don't have enough time. Like, I, I will definitely watch that TV series. Uh, rumor has it that it's, 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 it's a dope, like, uh, the, the, there's a guy, yeah, Saul Goodman, who says, mm -hmm. I know a guy who knows a guy who knows a guy. Exactly, <laughs> exactly. So who's take that guy? They, they take like it's the end the the way this one ends is fills in some whole how the way uh, better call Saul ends fills in some information and holes from the end of Breaking Bad. What do you think also, about? Huh? Go ahead. What, what do you think about Walter White? Was he a good man or a bad guy? He was he was a good man that money ruined. Because drug money, that much money because will make it. Because it was greedy. Bad. It was greedy. He got greedy. Yeah. 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 And he got, he was what? But it, I think, his motive, just think of a second. His motive was to fulfill all the desires of his family. Right? Well, his intention. usually what they he, say he his motive intention. is. He had a good right. intention and motive. Well, yes, but it, you find out later that there's more to it than just that because he was kind of put down and disregarded when he was really, really a really smart guy and smarter than the people around him. But imagine no one gave him credit. Yeah, imagine that. Just put yourself uh, in his suit. Think of a second. Oh, yeah. that what would you do? Like if you're going through, uh, you know, uh, a disease uh, like Walter White and uh, you, you don't have enough money. The money is oh, yeah. short for you, right? Being a teacher, a brilliant teacher, you can't make enough money in a month. And you got enough time to leave. And uh, a ba you, you, uh, your wife is expecting a baby. So you got to do lots of things because there are so many bowls in this atmosphere in the air. So what would you do? What would you do? You're going to do anything you possibly can because you think you're going to die and you want to leave them taken care of. You don't want to leave them in debt. So yeah, you would do anything you possibly can to, to get ahead. I think it was right. I think it was right. But what he did on this journey was not good. He killed well, his no, own. He became, he became the bad guy. He became yeah, the, the, he became the, the I'm not in danger. Yeah. Right. Have, you, have you ever seen the, the, the Hindu show, uh, White Tiger? Yeah, I've seen a little bit. I, I, he, I watched the first episode, but I, I was like, no, not interested, but I would watch again, watch it it's again. It's kind of like the Breaking Bad of, of, of India without the drugs. He, he, he takes driving and helping from a basic poor guy to and watching everybody around him, learning what they know. And he takes it to the next level of being a bad guy and, exactly. and making money out of it. Yeah. So I, I was saying something. Um, I'm uh -huh. sorry to interrupt you. But we've got one minute. Go so, um, like, uh, could you just suggest me to watch something and listen something so that I can improve my American accent pronunciation? An American Thanks. show. Um, we've got a few seconds. We've got. You want to be neutral English? Neutral English as old of a program as possible like uh i love lucy leave it to beaver uh my three sons old tv shows like that they speak clearly they speak slowly and they speak mostly proper english not all the not all the junk that you hear so and not different accents they speak a clear white middle class accent so if you okay. want the most neutral as old, a black and white TV show from the U.S., watch that. Leave it to Beaver would be my best one. I got it. Got it. So 
if you're going to do a program, do that. Otherwise, every movie you possibly can watch. Every movie. Yeah. 